We are here today to share with Ruby and Brian this very significant moment in their lives as they become a married couple. The most wonderful of all things in life is the discovery of another human being with whom one's relationship has growing depth, beauty, and joy as the years increase. This inner progressiveness of love between two people is the most marvelous thing. It cannot be found by looking for it or passionately wishing for it, although it brings new meaning to the lives of those who experience it. It's been nearly 10 years since you first began your journey together. Throughout that time, you have each overcome barriers as individuals and experienced personal growth on independent quests to find the meaning of love and life, each looking for a happy and balanced future as you thrived upon each other's presence and refuge, loving and learning and realizing that at some point along the way, life's trials weren't so threatening, as long as you had a safe space within one another. Now, to make a marriage work, we learn the importance of unconditional love, patience, strength, courage, and a really good sense of humor will allow your marriage to be diverse and incredibly fulfilling. Marriage is believing in one another and cheering each other on through life. It's someone you know feels the same way about you as you feel about them. It is having a confidant, a partner in crime, and a best friend. Ruby and Brian, as you join hands, please remember this moment in time together. These are the hands of your best friend, strong and full of love for you, that are holding yours on your wedding day. These are the hands that will passionately love you and cherish you through the years, and with the slightest touch, will comfort you like no other. These are the hands that will give you strength when you need it, support and encouragement to pursue your dreams, and comfort in difficult times. And lastly, these are the hands that even years from now, will still be reaching for yours, giving you the same unspoken tenderness with just one touch. Do you, Brian, take Ruby to be a lawful married wife, to love and respect and be loyal to from this day forth? I do. And do you, Ruby, take Brian to be a lawfully married husband, to love and respect and be loyal to from this day forth? I do. Hi, Brian. Hi, Brian. Take you, Ruby. Take you, Ruby. To be my wife. To be my wife. Hi Ruby. Hi Ruby. Take you Brian. Take you Brian. To be my husband. To be my husband. I will always be open. I will always be open. And honest with you. And honest with you. I will respect you. I will respect you. And care for you. And care for you. I will cherish our love. I will cherish our love. And our friendship. And our friendship. And I will share my life with you always. And I will share my life with you always. Now at this point, you've heard the words of love and marriage. You've exchanged your vows and made your promises. You've celebrated your union with the giving and receiving of rings. You've kissed a thousand times and probably more, but today the feeling is new. No longer simply partners or just best friends, but you have now become husband and wife. Ruby and Brian, as I am standing here by the power vested in me by the state of Nevada and Clark County, it is my absolute honor and privilege to pronounce you husband and wife. And Brian, you may kiss your bride. Ow! <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> Woo!